Toy Chest here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Lego Star Wars Luke's Lens Beetle. It comes with 163 pieces, so let's go ahead and take a look at the minifigs. Starting off first, here we have Luke. Um, he has his original blue lightsaber. He also has uh, leg pointing as well. Um, and he has the original heel piece. And he doesn't have a second second face or any back pointing. So, a pretty plain minifigure. But that's it for Luke. So, let's go ahead and take a look at Obi-Wan Kenobi. Um, or Ben Kenobi, whichever one he'll prefer to use. Um, he also has his uh, blue lightsaber. Um, he has pointy, uh, pretty nice uh, pointing on his torso, but he doesn't have leg pointing either. Um, there's just a better look at his uh, first face. And again, no second face or any back pointing. Now let's go ahead and take a look at C-3PO. Um, as you can see, he's a uh, pretty shiny um, gold color. It looks really nice. And the mold for his head is pretty good as well. Um, but he doesn't have the yellow pointed eyes inside like the uh, newer C-3PO's have. Um, but I really like the color of gold for him. And then there is the back pointing and the back of the head as well. Now let's go ahead and move on to R2-D2. Um, as you can see, he has really nice pointing in the front of his um, cylinder piece. Um, and he can do a backflip. <laughs> um, and his dome head is a uh, pretty uh, nice pointed piece uh, too. And then just there's the back. And the top of his uh, dome head is completely pointed too. Now let's go ahead and move on to the uh, Stormtrooper right here. Um, again, uh, he has um, just a like, little pointing for a Stormtrooper, but it's still pretty nice. He just has his right little uh, blaster. And he has the uh, cloth uh, pauldron as well. And there's his face. Just a plain black minifigure head for him. And he also does have this uh, backpack uh, piece as well. Which we are now going to take off to take a look at his uh, pointing on the back of his torso. There it is. Nothing uh, too fancy. Let's go ahead and put the uh, pauldron and the uh, backpack piece back on. Won't take very long. Um, I wish they did include at least some kind of pointing on the uh, uh, head. Um, because plain black isn't very good. I mean, they didn't even use clones in the Stormtrooper army. So I, just a generic head would have been nice. But now let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, sentry droid. Um, as you can see, he has this uh, clear base. and So the droid is just this uh, piece up here. This is just to make it look like it's hovering. Um, he has a little antenna right here and the red eye right there. But that's it for him. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the Lance Beetle itself. Um, as you can see, uh, it's mostly just tan and it has quite a bit of red in it as well. And the um, like uh, jet pieces, I guess, are different on this side, from this side, as you can see there. Um, and they can kind of move a little bit. But you have uh, pretty nice uh, detailing up at the front. And you have these hoses going around. 
and there is the underneath. Um, and you can sit uh, Obi Wan and Luke in the seats, but where are you going to put his lightsabers? And you can lift this piece off to hold their lightsabers. You just um, take their lightsabers. You're gonna split them apart. You're just gonna put them the lightsaber here in that red piece. Uh, right there, and here's the lightsaber piece right there. Just do the same with Luke's lightsaber. Just like that. And you can see that it holds them. You don't necessarily have to put the uh, lightsaber hilts in these uh, wood uh, pieces right there, but it's a nice little piece to put them in. And you can put that back there. And so if I just take Luke, you can put him in the uh, driver's seat, just like that. Then put Ben or Obi-Wan in the passenger seat. And then you can take um, R2-D2 and you can put him just right there. You don't really have places for the droid, so you just kind of uh, throw them back here. Then you can set C3PO right there, so you can have all of them just uh, riding along in the land speeder. Just kind of flying across the screen. And it does have this uh, nice cold windshield in the font as well. And it doesn't have any stickers or anything on this, which is nice. And it was a nice build also, but that is it for this uh, set. So just getting everything ready. Um, that is it for the set. I really like the build in it, and um, I think the price is pretty good for it. I mean, you get six minifigures, and the and R two D two and C three PO in a set together is uh, pretty nice as well. Um, but that is it for the set. So remember to like. And subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!